Okay, I'm recording as far as videos of my uh, springboard diving career. As far as this is from from Super 8 movies back. This this is this is a movie back um, in 1977. We we're in Omaha, Nebraska. As far as visiting some friends on the way back to Oregon. So th this is going to be my first video of um, of my diving, which I don't know. Which at this point I don't know a thing about diving. And this is the night before where all I can really do is hand scenes. I can't even dive off as far as this point. This is my friend David. He can do a nice little little uh, dive there. There's Cheryl. About 30 years ago, or 1977. That's when it was. Okay, here's me, here's me doing something stupid. As far as uh. This is all I can do. I can do handstands. Okay, this is the next day, so we go back out to the pool. Here's me diving straight up. As far as don't even, as far as don't even jump, jump up in the air, just starts straight out there. And quality's not, you know, not very good, but this is the earliest that I have. There's me walking there to the diving board. Did you know there's straight out dive on and go up in the air at all? Straight out there. There's me and David. Here's David, as far as he does a nice little dive here, gets up in the air, me playing around with the handstands, didn't get that one, didn't, uh, about got that one, pretty good, I was just learning how, didn't know how to get off it, I don't know what I'm doing here, something stupid, and David's got a nice little backflip. And I get I get a pretty good one there. I could press up back then too, so I've, that's something I can't do right now. Hoping to be able to do again someday. And here's me doing this another this other one, reverse one. Where I wish I was that strong now, but as far as uh, didn't quite get it. And okay, this is about a year later. As far as so this is this is Kelly and the elephant. Then I got a little diving scene. Um, I practiced as far as in Klamath Falls, Oregon, as far as at, uh, I was in the, in the Air Force then, and um, I was, I'll just play it. So, had the summer, Cheryl went home to visit family, so I had nothing better to do but hang out at the pool, so got my one and a half, all I really wanted to do was just a one and a half, and there I got, I, I got a double there, and I started playing with backward dives, never did a backflip back then, but I I did these dives here where these reverse jackknives and got pretty good at that. And I get a pretty good layout there. And I think I'm doing a gainer here. That's pretty good. So that was in 78. As far as when I did that, as far as didn't have anything else to do. So I just go to the pool and just practice my, my diving skills. Okay, now we're about probably 1981 or so. We're back in Kalamazoo and uh, play it. So it's coming up where I'm going to be at a public pool in Kalamazoo. I think it's the Uptown Park pool. So I got access to a high board now. So I've added a little bit to my skills. Got my my one and a half down pretty good for a for an amateur. And got my jackknife there. There's Kelly. Got my layout. And gainer. And trying to trying to do a twist, but I never learned how to do that as far as it looks all crazy. But I was trying to work up to a twisting one and a half, but I just couldn't get the, the uh, twist down very good. I worked a little bit off the high board, which I never really felt that comfortable on that stuff. But one and a half. There's, a, there's my two and a half and slow motion. That's probably the best dive that I've gotten as far as just two and a half. And a gainer. And get a layout. I'll pull a double on the double gainer there on the low board there. 
Not quite clean, but almost. And it's a little better. Didn't extend out, but I stayed balled up. Of course, my handstands. I've been doing those for forever. I could arch pretty good back then. And it's still crazy twisting stuff, which like I said, I never, never got down. And try going there. That one wasn't, that one kind of hurt this one. I remember this one, this one really stung. And uh, I decided that's it. I was done after that stuff, so. That's, that's my diving career. I gave it up soon after that as far as um, just, I guess life got in the way or something, but uh, that's the extent of my diving career.